The Cardinals are happy to be back home, and they get a welcoming sight. The Colorado Rockies, I mean, if you're looking for hits, who else would be better to face? Of course, better in cores, but St. Louis on a win streak just swept the Astros. Fernandez looking to make a nice impact in his first major league game. And he'll be facing Matty L, 3-4 and four on the year, but that ERA just shy of 3.3. And he'd get off to a slow start. Nolan Jones, hidden one, that's a single, play at the plate, not a great throw. So, one nothing Colorado. For them, Herman on the mound, 3-7 and seven on the year. And Brendan Donovan, 1-2. Yeah, perfect, perfect home run. A no-doubter for Donovan. I'll be honest with you. Didn't even know that was possible with this guy. First of the season. And we're knotted up at one. This would be an interesting game. Uh, Polanco. Looking to keep his hot back going. It's one off the wall and right. So that'll be a double. Newt Barr. Not able to do much. Neither was Gorman, so we have nothing to show for it. But Matt definitely would show some toughness in this one. A runner at third with two outs gets out of the inning. In the third, two outs, runner on. Gets McMahon the strikeout. It's hard to do. Fourth inning, first and second, Polanco. Look at this play. Comes charging just in time at first. Four nice innings. Jumping to the bottom of the eighth, you see it's still tied at one. Polanco just beats the throw. Two out single. Next pitch, new bar. Hidden one hard to right. That will get to the wall. Polanco chugging around third base. And guess what? A late lead for the Cardinals. We'll take it. Gallegos. 26.2 innings. Helsley getting some rest because his arm's a little tired. And Gallegos making it happen. So the Cardinals, winners 2-1. to one. Eight hits for the Rockies. Rodgers, Jones, and Diaz all with two. Chris Bryant, you know he loves to play in St. Louis. Great city, right? He had a double in this one. Herman, tough loss for him. Just allowed one run. Or sorry, no decision for him. Seven innings, eight hits, seven Ks, Gomber. Hmm. Might have been working double duty. He gets the L. So ten hits for the Cardinals. Four players with two. Notable Donovan and Newbar. They both drive in runs. Cardinals caught stealing twice. Hasn't happened too often. Matt didn't pitch bad. Just one run allowed over five and a third. Thompson, happy to have him get a win. Happy to have him back in Gallegos. Still super reliable, even though it's his first stage of the season. The Dodgers, 6-3 winners on the road. A couple of guys with two hits. A lot of guys with two runs driven in. Smith, Outman, and Hernandez all driving in two runs. Clayton Kershaw, perfect on the season so far, record-wise. 5-0. Oh. Two earned runs allowed. 7 Ks over 8 innings. Masterful, as we're used to seeing. For Pittsburgh, six hits. Brian Reynolds gets one. So that hit streak continues to go. 17 now for Mr. Reynolds. But Pittsburgh, unfortunately, does get the loss. The Johan, three and five. Rear and runs allowed, tough. But it's tough to pitch against the Dodgers. Minnesota, winners on the road, 5-2. Tried to blow a five-run lead, but they did pretty good. Lewis with three hits. Joe Ryan getting his fourth win of the season. Two runs allowed, but no earned runs allowed for him or the Twins in this one. For the Yankees, six hits. Mr. Soto, two-run home run in the sixth inning. It's all the offense you'd get for the Yankees. Ferguson getting the loss, three and two on the year. Four earned runs allowed over three and a third. So the Yankees just can't get back to 500. Working on it. But speaking of working on it, I see the Cardinals continue to work on this win streak. 